Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. The next Terror Raid event and Mass Outbreak events have been announced in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet and they have a very spooky theme to them because it is coming up Halloween and these events are all going to be featuring ghost type Pokemon. The next Terror Raid battle has been announced for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. This event will feature a battle against a Gengar with the ghost Terror type in five star Terror Raid battles. This event will run from midnight UTC on October the 28th and run over that weekend until 2359 UTC on October the 31st. So no seven star Terror Raid coming this weekend. We still have those two first partner Pokemon in the Feraligator and the Torterra to do, but we'll have to wait a little bit longer for those. And seeing as it is Halloween this week, it is kind of fitting, right? This is not all we're going to get this weekend. We are going to see another mass outbreak event coming to the games and it is going to be featuring all ghost type Pokemon, but this time it will only be featured in Paldea. So even if you haven't got the DLCs, you'll still be able to take part in the full version of this event. The next mass outbreak event has been announced for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. This event will feature a focus on Pokemon Ghastly, Mistrevious, Shuppet and Bramblin in Paldea only with an increased chance to get the crafty mark. So not increased shiny chances, but it's pretty nice to get an increased crafty mark. It is one of the nicer marks, in my opinion, at least. And again, this event will run the exact same time as the Gengar 5-star Terror Raid, which will run from midnight UTC on the 29th of October and all the way through to the 31st first at 2359 of course this is coming off the back of that version exclusive terror raid and mass outbreak event that's just finished in pokemon scarlet and violet and we're going to have another one where we don't have a seven star terror raid event again in game we've only got the feraligator and the torterra left when they'll appear hopefully after this halloween special terror raid and mass outbreak event and then that will lead us into that two year anniversary, which I believe is the 18th of November, which I'm hoping we get something pretty special for that. Maybe shiny Mariodon and Coriodon, which I'm kind of hoping for, but we'll have to wait and see. Maybe the seven star terror rays are going to be delayed until that two year anniversary, and then we'll kind of continue them from there. And we'll get maybe a special event around that time and maybe even Pokemon Presents. Who knows? We might get some news before Christmas about Pokemon Legends ZA, but we'll have to wait and see for that. That's all the news for today. Very quick video. Hope you're looking forward to the event at the weekend. Let me know what you've got planned for your Halloween festivities over the weekend. And will you be taking part in this event? I'll probably do some shiny hunting for these ghost types. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, in between all the other things that we've got going on but i hope you found today's video useful if you have do consider dropping a like it does really help do subscribe to the channel as well to stay up to date with all of these updates as well as our other pokemon skull and violet content that we do on the channel thank you so much for tuning in friends have a great rest of your day i don't speak to you before then enjoy halloween and i'll see you all in another video very soon so until then take care and bye bye